And I must say, very agreeable conditions here at the Etihad Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City, and they take on Sheffield United. Well, thank you, Derek. All the talking is done. Time now to put the coach's plans into action. Let's hope both teams really have a go at each other from the start of this match. It should be a cracker. And so they start at 11 for Manchester City. Ederson between the posts. Benjamin Mendy plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. And leading the line is Sergio Aguero. It's all about translating threats into goals. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Well, here's how the lineup looks for Sheffield United. And Ederson makes a really difficult save. Well, he's good with his feet. He's even better with his hands. Corner kick played over. The fist of the goalkeeper. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it a go on the counter. And attempting the through ball. Sterling. And crossed in there, and the cross not quite accurate enough. Bernardo Silva. Here's Aguero. Thou shalt not pass was the message delivered. And delivered by Bernardo Silva here. The high press was... It has to be! And the ball's on the net from Manchester City! Well, you get the feeling, no matter how difficult the exam paper, this man will excel in front of goal. Well, it's good build-up, but there's one player standing in front of the goal, and it falls to him, and he's not going to miss from there. And so the game back in business. City ahead here. Number seven, Raheem Sterling. Marcao looks promising this what can he do from here Postigo well I must say he acquitted himself well under pressure he must finish and the keeper would have been disappointed had he not dealt with it corner awarded and firing it into the area he succeeded in getting his fist to it the cross is on Not problematic for the keeper. Now, Mendy. It is to be a throw-in. Ruben Vinagre. Bernardo Silva read it superbly to take back possession. Beautifully weighted ball. Can they get in behind them? Surely the equaliser. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, when the run is timed to perfection and the ball is perfectly weighted, this is what you get, a great goal. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out, one apiece. Mendy. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Milinkovic Savic, teammate in support. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Well, that was the chance to take the lead, and the manager's frustration is there for all to see. 
They've decided to take the corner short. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. And the ball with Milinkovic Savic. Options in the centre. Bernardo Silva. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Well, that could be his final rebuke, I think. And the referee's making that absolutely clear. Oh, I like that, Derek. Good refereeing. Nice and strong. Told the player exactly what he was thinking. Well, nothing wrong with the header, but it was always going that little bit off target. Armstrong. Dumbia. That's fine play to so keep control of the ball. Sterling. De Bruyne. It's there for him. And the keeper gets in the way. Milinkovic Savic. Danger averted. Dani Rodriguez. Looking confident with the ball at his feet. Speculative ball fired to the near post. Gets his glove on it. Well, City controlling the lion's share of possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Let's join Alan McAdally now because there's been a goal in the Bournemouth game. Alan. It's a goal for Bournemouth. 39 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And that is offside. Far from a good pass. Joao Cancelo. And Bernardo Silva has it. Space and time for the cross. Joao Cancelo. Aguero in the centre. And the cross not quite accurate enough. And he was in the right place to intercept. And Sterling has it. Excellent ball towards the front post. A punch-happy goalkeeper. What a vital intervention. And the danger cleared. The ball with Rodri. Rodri. Here's Milinkovic Savic. Will he finish? Keeper didn't quite do enough. And he has just veered into an offside position this time. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stick. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. John Egan. Mekti Burabia. Dumbia. Went in strongly, decisively. Delivering it into the box. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross, and he gets up well, and it's just wide. And they do like to press whenever they can. A real opening now. And it's there for him. He must finish. A bit sloppy in possession. 
Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Manchester City taking on Brighton. Yeah, I'm predicting a cracker there. Both teams will have a real go at each other, I'm sure. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. Can they take the lead here? And it's in for Manchester City. It really is a true force of nature. Well, let's have a look at that replay. As a defender, or all the defenders in the box, you've got to be a pessimist. You've got to expect something bad. Bad to happen. It's back off the keeper, and now it's in the back of the net. And so the game back in business. City ahead here. Receiving news of a goal in the Brighton match. Alan McAnally. It's a goal for Brighton and Hove Albion. 56 minutes played. 1 1. Many thanks, Alan. Well, there's been so much talk about a potential transfer, but it's potential no more. It's fact. Well, Derek, a fee of around 95. Oh, it's off the post. Well, I thought they were back in it. I thought they were back in the game, to be honest with you. Derek, how close can you get? Perfect through ball from Sergio Aguero. Playing with purpose and control. Milinkovic Savic. And a goal it is for Manchester City. They are the team on course for victory. Stop the supply, you stop the goal. We learned that one at school, Derek. Poor defending here. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Tremendous intuition to win it back. And fed forwards. And that is offside. Jan Valéry. Well, you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. City sit. And played through by Sterling. It should be! Great pressure to win the ball back. Smuggled away. Joao Cancelo. And teammates to play it to. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Armstrong. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. And over comes the corner. Oh, that's a goal at the wrong end. Well, it's every defender's nightmare. An own goal here. Let's have a look at that again. All defenders look away. Nobody likes to see this. It's poor, you have to say, but it's... It's important now that he puts his head back on and starts to concentrate on the rest of the game. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. My oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. The ball with Rodri. De Bruyne. Good visualisation and execution. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Ruben Vinagre. And you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that. 
Mares. Well, this might pay dividends. Great save following the close range effort. Look how close he gets to the goalkeeper. It's a really, really good save in the end. It's a short one. Well, that was simply miles off target. Dear me. Oh, close your eyes when you're watching this one. It's horrific. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax, Lee, but they ought to be pleased. Well, all the City players will be looking up at the clock. Time is ebbing away. They have such a delicate lead. Will they rue them? Great ball from Raheem Sterling. A very high degree of difficulty for any goalkeeper. Sheer quality. Quality of the shot and certainly quality of the save. Well, thumped clear. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, the City fans are certainly having a big say in this game so far. Listen to how loud the crowd are, urging their team forward. And getting the ball forward is the key for Manchester City here. Will there be any end products? Wonderful chance. And it's in for Manchester City. He's just so cool in front of goal. Well, as we can see, if a striker is free in the box and the great ones just stand still, they know chances will come in that position and he wasn't disappointed. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And a goal has been scored at the Vitality Stadium. Alan McAnally with the details. It's the second goal for Bournemouth. Six minutes remain. 2-1. Thanks, Alan. Gabriel Jesus now. Now, can he deliver accurately? De Bruyne, ball lost. And you don't. Bernardo Silva sliding it through. Well, it's goal after goal after goal. Just no end to this. A brilliant display. Well, here it is. How do you like him? In an open goal, please. No goalkeeper, no defenders. Where were they all? It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Well, not really a shooting moment he's going to be especially proud of, Lee. Well, he did have other options, but he thought, you know what, I'm just going to have a go. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Gabriel Jesus now. And there it is, the final whistle. And delivered by...